What's up everybody, it's Landon and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Um, here we're going to continue on over this way. You want to be smart about this. There's another guy with a lantern over here. There he is right there. I don't know if you can see him in the top corner. Um, nobody in this area is going to get up to attack you if you kill him. We need to kill him quick and I'm going to wait for him to come back. It's a nice little bait and switch kind of game. Waiting game. Cat and mouse. Um, let's sit down. I realized I didn't do the adios wave. I was running out of time. It's fine. He's back. Run. Kill this fool. Before he does anything. Alright, he's dead. That's what we wanted. You do not want him to call his hands off. That's a big mess waiting to happen. You don't need it. Come over here, kill those two. The ones that are glowing will actually fight back, is what I've noticed. Um, so we're gonna kill him. Kill him. This one has a shield. A little bit more tough. Yep, there he is. Oop. But he's dead. So it doesn't matter. Um, I don't believe there's anything over here. Yes, there is, actually. There is something down there. I think it's a different entryway into where we're going anyway. But, yeah. We're gonna run up here. Be cautious. Go up here. Back down. Oh, that works. You heard him. What did I need? I've never had him do that. He usually comes running down that staircase, tries to charge at you. That's why I said back up. Um, these trousers might actually be better than the ones we're using. Let me see. Oh, uh, they're better on weight. That's about it. So forget that. Come up here. This guy's usually throwing fire bombs at you. The dude with the lantern awakens him. But now he's just choking. So we're gonna kill him. Try to make this as stressful as stressless as possible. As stressful as possible. Pillage these remains. We got some binoculars, dog. I'm gonna put those in our little hot bar here. And then you can just kind of look around. You get a closer look on everything. See all the architecture, it's nice. Look out around your surroundings, get to jump on enemies, you know, the good stuff. Alright, we're gonna run back down here. Make sure that gesture's still on there again. Just... I don't think I'm missing anything. I'm about to sneeze though. Don't sneeze. Don't sneeze. Okay, we're fine. For now. Oh god, it's going back. Uh, here's the item. Give me a second. I'm gonna try to stop my seas. I apologize. Like I said, I have the sinus drainage. Any of you all have sinuses, you relate. You share my pain. Okay, I think we stopped it for real that time. Grab this. Gold pine resin. I believe that does fire damage? No, lightning. Sorry. This is like the fire paper and bolt paper in Bloodborne. Except there's a lot more varieties. There's a dark, there's fire, there is lightning, there's a, might be frost? I haven't seen any yet. Um there's one other one. I don't know. I can't think right now. But yeah. You apply this to your weapon, puts lightning damage on it. It's pretty nice. Especially against enemies that are like shielded, covered in armor. Good stuff. I'm gonna run over here, kill this guy before you get shot. Ta da! Break this table. You can obviously see that dude. If you can't, I'll point him out. Right there! <laughs> He's supposed to get the jump on these those boxes. He's we got some more fire bombs, that's something good. Nope. Still got me. I knew he was coming, he still got me. That's crap. Okay. See all those enemies over here? Don't really have to worry about them. At all. Okay. I'm gonna skip the ladder and just drop down here. These ladder animations take forever. <laughs> Come over here, grab this. It's another soul of a deserted corpse. 
So, so far so good. We're, we're making good progress. I'm gonna draw this guy over here. We'll see why in a minute. Well, maybe if I can get him Come on. Come on. Oh, you turd. Watch out for that guy. I knew he was there. He still freaking got me. Kill him. Then we're gonna run up the staircase and watch something amazing. <laughs> Never get gold. You stand right here, you will go on there. Don't worry. This is where those enemies were that I was just talking about in the game. That's why you don't have to worry about it. Because, uh, Fire Eyes over here takes care of them. Uh, if you haven't noticed, this guy is a lot. <laughs> We're not gonna mess with him. Um, oh, you made your way all the way over here. Well, come back down here and kill him if he's right there. Oh, if you stand here, he's gonna kill all the enemies in that little area right there, as you just saw. <laughs> you may feel like you're trapped. Just <laughs> But you're not. Wait for him to do that, and run. Run, 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 run. All the way over here, this is your safe zone. This is where you want to be like, Yeah, I'm fine. See, so you didn't do it. Oh, he's still doing it. I don't know why. I guess I still triggered him right there. Up here is a new enemy. It's a, uh, ah! The Red Knight. He's a pain in the butt. But he is very killed. He becomes super intimidating. I'm gonna chug and ask this. Oh! That was a bad start. Come on! Just be smart about your movements. They're pretty clunky, they're not that bad. These guys are gonna come to life. Kill them. He takes three shots, this one's gonna take two. If you have this weapon, of course. If you don't wanna do this build, that's fine. Do whatever you want. This guy's just gonna sit here, three souls, grab the soul with his every corpse. Surprised he didn't drop anything. Um, over here, again, a door you can't open. That's where the dragon is, there's another way through. We'll worry about it later. And here, I don't know if it's a glitch, they might have patched this. But see that guy right there? He's supposed to jump out and try to kill you. But it looks like his animation is... See? He just... He flies right past you. Completely past you, I don't... It's weird. Uh, here's some notes, could this be a miscreant? Bonfire ahead? Yeah. Well, there you go, there's bonfire ahead. There's also a firebomb here, we're gonna fall down and kill this guy. This guy is gonna immediately wake up. Ow! 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 Whew, that was close. They're quick little buggers. They're quickens. Let's, uh, run over here. Oh. Actually, let's not. That's not where we want to go. We want to go up. I don't know why I want to go up. We don't want to go there. We do have 2,500 souls now, though. I'm rounding down. So I think we're going to head back and buy some very much needed stuff. Light this bonfire. I believe there is an item over here. Yes, indeed there is. Memory isn't screwing me up yet. Another Titanite shard, and that's what we need to upgrade our weapons. We're gonna rest the bonfire. We're actually gonna travel back to Firelink Shrine. So there you go, there's the first, I would say, third of the area. It's not bad at all. If you know what you're doing, you're patient. 
It's terrible. It's completely bad. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Uh, I mean, come over here, talk to you, uh, cheapskate. You're going to buy that heal aid like a boss. You're going to also buy this talisman like a boss. And do we have enough? Oh, we don't have enough. I'm 300 souls shy of getting that. Oh, that sucks. Can get a repair powder. I'm not going to worry about it right now. Like I said, I haven't been needing it. But I always like to have it on hand just, just because it's there. Um, we will, however, buy. Not that much. Uh, do I want to right now? <laughs> I don't want to do that right now. That's all we're going to buy for now. Let's uh, equip our talisman. And we're also going to set our new miracle up. It's not going to work with your staff need a talisman. This talisman is perfect for that basic spell. We're going to take Spook off. I don't need it right now. Actually, I haven't used it since I've switched these. Uh, now we have Heal Aid on, and I'll show you what that does. We switched our talisman, switched to Heal Aid. Your health was low, was to be low, that would heal you. Right there. A good chunk, too. Not all the way, but decent. And then you can just switch back to the Farin Dart with your staff if you needed to. Switch back to your shield. And there you have it. That's it. I'm gonna pop another squat. <laughs> and um, I found out these undead bone shards, they're not actually um, what I was thinking they were, like boosting the level, the bonfire level in the area. I don't know what item does that. I can't remember if it's the same as the Dark Souls 2. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but that doesn't do that. It actually increases the amount of healing you get from an Estus Blast. So that is a good thing to burn in there if you ever get one. I've only gotten one, and I can't quite remember where it was, but I'm sure we will pick it up because I'm very thorough on what I do. Um, you can always talk to people in the area. Sometimes they'll have something new to say, sometimes they'll give you a gesture. I don't know if this guy would or not. We need to allot Estes. But wait, but so. Blah 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 blah. That's all I hear. Um. Nothing there. I skipped through a lot of the dialogue, especially if it's the same, like her. She hardly ever says anything new. See if you've got something to say. What a sick at all. What a at Okay. Nothing to say. So, let's travel back to where we were. Tower on the wall, the new bonfire we just lit. Once we get there, I'll end the video there. And we'll continue on. Through the high wall of Lothric. Castle is seriously epic. I love it. <laughs> Reminds me of Dark Souls 1 with the dragon that burns the bridge on top of the tower. We all have to play that game. It's so freaking awesome. There he is still. He didn't leave. He's always gonna be there. Pop a squat. Cause why not? And we'll end the episode here. As always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Are you?